been doing in Africa for the last 13 years. We map uh, prices from FOB levels. We are also very uh, competent in fertilizer market intelligence. Before governments can craft their subsidy programs, they have relied on our data to sort of set the market and do uh, their own assessments. We have a one-of-a-kind uh, fertilizer pilot uh, blending plant at our headquarters where we work particularly with private research to uh, private companies to develop uh, new technologies. But we also do this in a way that is, uh, we look at fertilizer use much more holistically. So looking at things like integrated soil fertility management, uh, which combines both organic uh, and inorganic materials for much more better outcomes, better soil health, uh, and better environmental stewardship. Through the continent partnership with the IFPC and other development partners who are present uh, here today, my ministry has progressively made good strides in addressing issues related to soil fertility. We are gathered here in recognition of the importance of the fertilizers, which if efficiently and effectively used, can contribute more to more than 30% of our crop yields. So that means if you have to feed the population, we must use fertilizer. The platform that we are about to launch goes beyond visualizing fertilizer statistics. AFO is doing an incredible job of providing access to other type of information such as fertilizer trends, policies and regulation, subsidy programs, business and product directories, publications and news. What we need is national roadmaps that takes the specificities of each country into account, the potential to produce fertilizers, and what the potential as well to reduce yield gaps in those countries, and what does it mean in terms of fertilizer usage. Three, two, one.